we will talk about Osgood Schlatter disease. Why it's so important? Because it affects around 10% of young athletes aged 9 to 16. So it's an extremely common condition. Another reason, because it causes knee pain, which can last for several months, sometimes for several years. And it can importantly decrease quality of life of such children. That's why it's very important. And what is the symptoms? Symptom is sharp and throbbing pain just below the kneecap. This pain is exacerbated by running, jumping, or other physical activity. Sometimes children notice here swelling or lump. This swelling is caused by inflammation and it's visible sometimes or tender when you touch it or tenderness during palpation. Now let's say what is mechanism, what causes Osgood-Schlatter disease. Main mechanism is repetitive stress and the tension of patellar tendon. Patellar tendon is here and here you can see and repetitive stress of this tendon causes micro traumas and inflammatory processes here and this inflammation causes pain and symptoms now let's say what is treatment and diagnosis diagnosis usually based on clinical picture no need x-ray or other imaging techniques if there is uh, serial suspicion of other disease is possible but usually these symptoms pain just below the kneecap which is exacerbated during exercise and if kid is athlete or physically very active and uh, if this pain relieved by rest and relieved by uh, non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drug it's usually osgood slaughter disease because it's extremely common disease and treatment is conservative wrist ice compression elevation which is also known as rice protocol so treatment is this treatment usually enough ibuprofen is prescribed sometimes because of pain and inflammation and other anti-inflammatory drugs also possible non-steroidals such as aspirin or naproxen but ibuprofen usually is enough and here's important point complete cessation of physical activity is not recommended but maintain some physical activity and exercises which has low impact on knee it's important not to cause atrophy of leg muscles it's important point here that rest is good of course but complete cessation of physical activity is not good prognosis is very favorable in 90 percent of cases usually no complication usually no problem it will resolve itself by age of 16 or it can resolve resolve itself within several months thank you for your interest thank you for your watching if you like my videos please thumbs up if you like my channel please subscribe thank you very much bye for now